before we begin, are you sure that you're in a position to conduct this negotiation? Yes, I have the authority to negotiate with you. Right. Let's get down to business. Which of our product lines are you particularly interested in, Mr. McNeil? I could be interested in these ones that I have outlined here. But I want to hear what you say about discounts. Let's talk specifically about Big Boss. Let's be clear about one thing. I hope you realize that we must have a much larger discount than what's on the table now. I think the discount problem can be resolved. But you need to be more precise about numbers. Fair enough. What kind of discount are you offering on 10,000 units? On 10,000 units, Mr. McNeil, I can offer a discount of 30%. But I can't offer more. 30%? Just let me finish. 30%, but with a guarantee of delivery within two months. Delivery must be within two months, or I'm not interested. I am offering you the chance to make a very large sale, and you are turning it down because we're... Can I just come in here, Mr. McNeil? I haven't turned anything down. I haven't said no. I am just saying that on 10,000 units, our discount terms are 30%. But... Please let me finish. Now, if you commit to buy 20,000 units, then I could consider a larger discount. How much larger? If you commit to 20,000 units, then I can offer a 35% discount. 30, 35%. I'm getting tired of this. You are playing games. I am looking for a large discount, and I hope that you're going to offer me one. If you want a big discount, then you must make the order a big one. Let's talk about unit price rather than discount. Our standard unit price to the wholesaler is 23.5. And I'm not interested in 23.5. Yes, I know that, Mr. McNeil. If you buy 40,000 units, then I can offer a unit price of 19.5. What will your markup be on the boss? Three? 3.5? Four? About that. With those figures, you're going to be very competitive. 19.5 unit price. If you buy 40,000 units. That represents a discount of... I have a calculator, too. I can see what the discount is. Offer me a unit price of 19.5 on 25,000 units, and we can do business. I can't do that. I'm sorry. Let's break for a few minutes. I've got a few things I have to see to. I'll be a couple of minutes. Would you like a cup of coffee? Yes, please. Help yourself to the phone if you want to make a call. Thanks. Don Bradley. Hi, Don. How's the meeting? It's just finished. I'm on my way over. How's your meeting? He's definitely interested. We're having a break. What's the situation? It's becoming difficult. We're stuck on the size of the order for Big Boss. He wants a unit price of 19.5 on an order of 25,000. 
That sounds good to me. I think we can push him further. Do you think so? I think so. I hope so. Be careful. He's a clever man. I've dealt with McNeil before. When he starts banging on the table, that's as far as you can go with him. Good luck. Thanks. So let's clarify the position so far. As far as Big Boss is concerned, we have agreed on a unit price of 20 for 30,000. And I can't go below that price for an order of this size. Now, let's look at terms of payment. 90 days. I'm sorry, Mr. McNeil, but that's completely unacceptable. Our standard policy on discounts of over 30% is payment within 30 days of delivery. This is not a standard situation. I am making a very large order. Can I just come in here, Mr. McNeil? I know you're making a large order, but you are also getting an excellent product at a very large discount. I can't believe that this is your final offer. If you order 35,000, then I can authorize payment in 90 days. We have already decided on quantity. This is my last offer. 30,000 at 60 days payment. Take it or leave it. I think that offer will be acceptable. So, all we have to do now is finalize the delivery arrangements. Well, let's discuss the details tomorrow. Come in. Don. How are you? Hello, Danny. Edward. I'm sorry I'm late. You are late. I'd rather do business with you than with this young man. What have you been feeding him? Oh, we don't feed him. We like to keep our staff hungry. <laughs> 